This video shocked millions of Turks. It was recorded during the constitutional referendum last year. The footage purports to show dozens of ballot papers being stamped as valid after the vote. Banu Varda and her colleagues are still angry at this apparent evidence of irregularities and the prospect of it happening again this year. This is one reason why many people think elections in Turkey are rigged. I don't believe last year's referendum really went the government's way. That's why we want to make sure there is no deception this time. Hello, we're trying to keep votes safe. Do you want to help? Banu and her fellow activists are out on the streets of Istanbul practically every day. They talk to voters and try to persuade them to sign up as election monitors. We're not from a political party, we're part of a citizen's initiative. Election monitors are allowed to be present at all polling stations in Turkey. Often there are not enough volunteers, but Banu wants to change that. In the conservative Istanbul district Eyüp, many residents are loyal supporters of President Erdogan. Banu is not having much luck here. Turkey's biggest opposition party, the CHP, has actually set up an election fraud center. It's better organized than Banu's volunteer initiative, but the goal is the same sending out observers and documenting suspected fraud. A lot of people had doubts about the result of the last election. Many thought it wasn't right. This public feeling has to be taken seriously. We say to citizens, cast your vote, but look out as well for what happens to it. Avni Özgürel writes for the pro-government newspaper Yeni Birlik. He says the opposition and some media exaggerate their claims of vote manipulation. Apart from a few local irregularities, I don't think there's anything wrong with our election security. But there have always been people who make such claims. They say things like votes have been stolen or burned or just thrown in the trash. It's been like this in all the elections. Banu Varda and her colleagues do not agree. They say the allegations of ballot rigging at the last vote have never been resolved. This time round, they hope the voting will be more secure. And they want to play a part in it.